Oh, she's got it. Got her. I got her. I got her. Oh my god, no way. No way. No way. Oh my god, it's a giant. Got her. Got her. I got her. I got her. Oh my god, it's a tank. Oh my god, it's a monster. Ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to be doing a little bit of a lot of different things. Welcome back. Uh, we got the big swim baits out on this fishing mission today, and we're going to be doing a little bit of pond hopping, spring pond hopping most importantly. We are finally in the fishing season, and there's no better way to start off a good fishing season than with big swim baits searching for big bass. You guys know I freaking love pond hopping. It is just, it's the best way to catch bass and, and spring fishing, finding them on bed, on a pond, in a new pond, in a new body of water. There's just no other better feeling than that. So today we are breaking out, like I said, the big swim baits and we're doing a little bit of exploring. We're gonna be searching for fish on bed today. We're gonna be searching for fish shallow. We're gonna be searching for fish everywhere in a bunch of different bodies of water. Now, if you look behind us, we're at a body of water we've actually never fished before which is an interesting way to start a video, but we thought it was cool. Like, like I said, today's all about exploring, trying new things. So we're gonna, we're gonna start the video off just how I want to, at a new body of water, at a place I've never fished before, and uh, throwing big swim baits. A little bit ambitious, but that's what today's about. All right, you guys know what I like to say. Let's see happen, more fishing, big swim baits, big spring bass. Hopefully a lot of big things happen today. Let's do it, it's gonna be fun. <laughs> What the heck? Someone's out here making a fire, dude. Dude, what the heck is going on with this pond? This is weird, bro. All right, well, I don't know exactly what we were thinking going to that first spot to start off the day. I've literally never fished there before. It was practically a ghost town where we were fishing, but regardless, we're at spot number two. And I'm liking it. It looks good. It's a small little quaint, relaxing pond, and uh, hopefully there's some big bass in it. You'll be surprised by the, the amount of big bass in small ponds like this, but hey, we're, we're looking for our first fish of the day. Let's keep throwing around these swim baits. Let's make it happen. It's gonna be good. We'll keep throwing around this mag draft, try and get us started. That's, that's just not the mag draft. Let's try that again. <laughs> we'll keep throwing around this mag draft just to get us started. I wanna move to the glide bait later today, but we gotta get something going for us here with a little, little mag draft action. I'm liking the looks of this spot. I think we could definitely make it happen. Oh, that's a good bass. Oh my God. Did you see it chase that bluegill? That was like a three, four pounder. That was actually just like a four pounder. That was a good fish. Come back, come on. No way, dude. Oh, he just chased that bluegill all the way up to the shallows. I was just about to mention how crystal clear this water is. I see a dark shadow come out of absolute nowhere chasing a, like a big bluegill up shallow. I wonder if he's got a bed all the way out there. Or she. We might have just found a little honey hole here. This is, that is so cool. Oh, there's a giant on bed right there. Dude, what in the world? Dude, I pull up right behind this little uh, drain type dealio. I see like one or two beds. And I haven't really seen any fish on bed here, surprisingly, because there's a lot of beds. And I see this one, I don't see a fish on it, and then like a six pounder, the back was like this thick. Just comes out right under the bank, swims away. Ooh, we might need to try and get this fish. All we have is big swim baits though, so if we can't, if it won't eat the swim bait, we're screwed. Oh wow though, that's a big boy. That's what we need. Uh-oh. Oh, she's back. That's a monster, bro. That's a monster. She's looking at right, right at me though. She knows we're here. She's not dumb. There's a darn children's toddler's birthday party going on to the left of us. If we catch this fish, we're gonna be like, Oh, she's looking at it. Oh, it's like a four. She's looking right at it though. Oh, dude. Oh, I'm stuck on a damn stick. Retreat, retreat. Oh, it's somebody else's line, bro. What the hell? Well, that was mission failed. Cheese and rice. She was interested in the swim bait though. 
That's a good sign right off the bat, even while we were right in front of her. We might have just messed that up a little bit though. That's fine though, as long as we're able to clean up some line, help out the environment a little bit. As I was saying, bro, if we catch this fish, there's like a toddler's birthday party going on right behind me. These kids are either gonna go completely unnoticed or they're gonna freak out and we're gonna have a whole entire uh, meeting about fish. Damn. There we go. All right, come on, big girl, where are you? I'm not even scared about not catching this fish. I'm scared about like five moms like screaming at me, like saying, put it back in the water, you're gonna kill it. Maybe the second I take it out of the water, we'll just have to crouch down. We'll have to run away. We'll have to bring it to the car, get some shots at the car and then release it. <laughs> Oh, they would freak out. They'd jump on our car, pop our wheels. Oh, she's got it. Got her. I got her. I got her. Oh my god, no way. No way. No way. Oh my god, that's a giant. That's a giant. Oh my god. Oh my freaking god. Dude, I couldn't even see her eat it. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, no freaking way. Alright, we gotta stay quiet. We don't want to just uh, have what I just explained happen right now. Oh my god, that's a good five, dude. <laughs> that just happened, baby. <laughs> I wasn't even looking at the damn bed. I was looking at the camera and this guy comes up and absolutely smokes it. Look at that girl, dude. Oh my god, we're gonna be quick with this fish. Like I said, there's a birthday party of 2,000 million kids behind us, so we're gonna get this big girl back healthy. Most importantly, fish health. But dude, the swim bait on the bed, do not underestimate. The big swim baits, do not underestimate the small ponds. Yes, dude, yes. All right, let's give her a dip, get some shots, and get her back. Dude, right off that bed. Shoot, this is the probably the most aggressive fish at this size range. I mean, I've, I've never found a fish this big and this aggressive. This girl was pretty heated the moment we, we saw her to the moment she ate. Yes, dude. That's a, that's a five pounder, baby. Let's go. What a way to start our day. <laughs> let's go. All right, well, already second pond of the day. And we got our five pounder, I think. We're not gonna weigh her. We're gonna get her straight back because she's on bed. She needs to protect those babies. This is exactly what this pond needs. A big girthy fish like this laying babies. But I'm gonna bet that's about a five pounder. I just can't believe how we caught her. <sighs> Sick, that's, that's so good. Yeah, right back where you belong. That water's warm, dude. Make sure she's healthy. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Let's go. I'm feeling pumped. I'm feeling good. Dark fish looked like a Florida fish. All right, let's keep fishing. Might, might, might just have to go head to the next spot after that, but yes, dude. I'm still a little bit in shock on how that fish ate it. I was I, like, you, I've never had a fish take it without me even seeing it, especially on bed, especially fish of that size. She just started swimming away with it. I was like, huh? <laughs> this doesn't make any sense. This is not how it normally goes. I gave a light hook set. I had treble hooks. You don't need to slam a hook set, especially when it's right near the bank. She came up. That's when uh, I realized we actually had a fish on. Let's go, dude. All right, next spot. A little sus, a lot of no parking signs, but you know what that means? It means there's fish. Let's go find them, baby. All right, I'm liking this spot, baby. That's my favorite spot so far. There's a lot of beds shallow. I'm not seeing any fish on them at the moment. But the water's fairly clear for a spot like this where there's a highway 20 feet off the other side of this fence. There's a fish. Well, that's a good one, baby. It's like a two, three pounder. Oh no, that's like a four. There's a little male on bed I didn't even see, but a four pounder female I assume just swam by behind them. Oh, here she comes. That's a good fish, dude. Oh, both of them are good. It's like a five, bro. There's like a two and a five staring at it. 
both real good fish. Let's just hope that's her bed and she's not just overly hungry. There we go. Yep. Oh, she smoked it. Smoked the head, dude. Yo, did you see that? Oh my god, that's so sick. She's circling. She's about to hit it. Oh, she swam off. Oh, one of them had it. It was the oh, it was the freaking female. I'm an idiot. I'm a freaking idiot. My brain is a rock, dude. She's coming in hot. Oh, I thought she had it. Oh my God. Oh, she just smoked it. Yep, got her. Got her, baby. There we go. Good fish. Good fish, dude. That's a good one. Get her up on the sand. There we go, baby. Let's just grab her. Oh. <laughs> yes, dude. <laughs> that was so sick. <laughs> Look at that, baby. Look at that fish. She's, she's nothing huge, but she's a solid fish, dude. Especially especially on the swim bait off bed in a little urban pond like this. Oh my God. All right, I thought she was a little bit bigger. I'm not gonna lie. She's heavy though, I'll tell you that. Look at her a little bit of oxyclean. That is that is so awesome. All right, it's it's not like a five, six. It's not even a four. It might be four, but it's a good fish, dude. We're, we're two fish deep for like, probably pushing eight, nine pounds. That's sick. That is sick. Off bed, two for two. Two for two with the trout swim bait as well. That is so cool. We worked this fish for a hot minute and she was aggressive the whole time. We'll get a couple shots of her and let her go. That is, that is awesome, dude. Let's go. So there's another reason why you go uh, pond hopping with the big swim baits, dude. All right, big girl, we'll see you later. Get back on that bed. Check those babies. Oh, she's pissed, dude. We're two fish deep for like nine pounds. Let's get another, dude, another big one. I'm feeling good. That's awesome. Is that a fish right there? That is a fish. He's checking it out. Oh, dude, he's a, oh, I got him. Oh, I had him. Oh, I had him. He's a solid fish, actually. He's a little bigger than I thought. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah, he's mad, dude. He is pissed. There we go. Oh, oh, he just smoked it. It's so hard to tell. His bed is fairly deep. It's like in two, three foot of water. And then the wind is just, oh, got him. Oh, that, I don't think that's him. I think that might be the male. There we go, though. Oh, actually, he's a salt. No, no, dude, no. Ah, are you kidding me? He was like a two, three pounder. He wasn't anything big, but I, I, he kind of surprised me. Oh man, I was not expecting that. I pulled my damn bait off the bed, and you came up and smoked it, dude. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, that's a huge bass. Oh my God. That's like a six, seven pounder, bro. Hold on a second. I think I just popped him off a of bed. I can't tell. He's just sitting. Oh my God, that's a big fish. I'm gonna cast away out in front of him. I thought I just spooked like a one pounder off the bed. That fish gained a lot of weight really fast to my eyes at least. Oh my God, that was a big one, dude. He turned back around and kind of came back to his spot like he was on bed, though. If he's on bed, it's quite far out there, but that doesn't make it impossible to catch him. I don't know, let's investigate a little bit. 
Oh, there's the female. She's back there. That's a big, whoo. That is a big fish, dude. We're just gonna let the swim bait sit on the bed. I don't know how the hell we're gonna land the fish if we hook her right here. I'm gonna have to jump in the water and grab her. She keeps the male, the male's checking out my, my bait right now. I mean, not anymore, but he keeps coming back to the bed. The female is kind of a little bit more anxious. She's a little bit smarter, but she's a lot, lot bigger. With size comes intelligence. Oh, here comes the female. Female's, female's rolling in. Oh, my heart is racing, bro. Oh my God, here she comes. Oh, she is big, dude. That is a proper fish. Oh my God, she's nosing it, dude. No, bro, chill. Do not get the hooks. He keeps the little guy, the two pounder, keeps absolutely smoking it. I'm not, I'm not trying to hook him. Uh oh, she's got it. Oh my God, she had it. That was her, that was not the male. She had it, bro. Oh, I should have set. No, don't, can't get antsy. We're finally getting there. Got her, got her, I got her, I got her. Oh my God, it's a tank. Oh my God, it's a monster. Oh my God, no! Yeah, that was like an eight. Bro, my heart is beating so fast. I knew it was gonna happen. I knew we were gonna lose that fish. I mean, look at what we're working with here. Ah, <sighs> dude. My fingers are really shaking, bro. That was like an eight. We might get a second chance at her. I had her, bro. She was aggressive for a female, I'll tell you that. She was mean. We might get a second chance at her. What we're gonna do is we're gonna back up like 20 feet for like seven minutes. We'll give it another shot here soon. That was huge. Look at what we're working with. The goal, the game plan right here is to hook her, bring her, I was running that way because I wanted to, my, my best chance was get her on that sand, jump down, grab her. It was either that or drag her all the way over there, but obviously I can't flip her. That's not, that's not an option. It was either get her on that sand, go down, grab her. I thought I had her in, bro. All right, back up, we'll be back. We gotta give it another shot. <sighs> the fifth stage of depression is acceptance. Uh, I think we're gonna have to accept what just happened there and move on, yeah. Uh, honestly, honestly, you know what? I think I'm happy we lost that big fish. No, dude, god dang. It just hit me what just happened. We actually did just lose that big fish. All right, well, that's fine. Like I said, the fifth stage of depression is acceptance. We got one more pond on the menu. That means we got one more chance to catch a fish that is uh, bigger than eight pounds. Eight pounds, honestly, that's a dink. 10 pounder, here we come. Fifth pond. Wait, fourth pond, big swim baits, big bass. Let's do it. All right, let's go, baby. Energy is high. It's probably gonna be the final pond of the day. We're going straight into it. We ain't wasting no time. We gotta catch some fish, dude. As much as I feel like we've caught like 100 fish, we've only got, I think, two or three on the day. This pond looks good. I'm liking, I'm liking it. Let's finish strong here. Oh, big one falling. Yep. Yeah. Oh, no, that's a giant. No, 
That was like a four or five pounder. Okay, that wasn't a giant, but dude, I watched him come up and eat it. He just stole my only mag draft. Dude, you're kidding me. Oh my God, he just broke the leader. Dude, I watched him come up and hit it. I barely even got a hook set. Wow, what a way to start the last pond. We just lost an eight, we just lost a five. Let's keep going, baby. We just got punched in the face twice, about as hard as someone can get punched in the face as a fisherman. This day started great. Now we're just losing big fish left and right. <laughs> That's all right though. Let's just keep fishing. That means there's more big ones. One just got something just hit way up shallow there. Come on, I got a good feeling about this pond, man. Nearly three casts in, we just broke off a five pounder. Oh man, that feels so. That's a big one. That's a good one. No way. No way. No way. We cannot lose this fish. You're getting up here. You're getting up here. Yes, baby. Yes. Yes. Yes, dude. <sighs> dude, come on, baby. Come on. I know he ain't big, but he's good, dude. That looks just, that looks like the exact same size as the one I just lost. Come on. <sighs> that's what I'm talking about. That's, that's why we keep fishing, baby. I don't care. We just lost an eight. We just lost some, broke off on a five. But hey, we made another cast and uh, we got ourselves a good fish right there. That's every bit of four, three and a half, four pounder. He's kind of hooked bad. We're gonna, he might, he's stuck in the eye, so. This is gonna be a tricky unhook. I'm sorry, bud. I got you just around the edges of the eye. All right, we're good. We just got him on the sockets. I think he'll be good to go. Well, I'll tell you what, dude. Today has been a mix of a lot of raw emotions from excitement to disappointment to anger. And it all ends up circling back around to excitement. That, that's a good fish. And I guess welcome to spot number four. We're five minutes in. And we already got a, we already got ourselves a good a good fish. All right, buddy, we'll get you back. Beautiful, beautiful fish. I really appreciate you, dude. If you if you hadn't um if you hadn't come up to hit this thing, I don't know what I would have done with myself. Oh, there she goes. She's strong, baby. Yes, sir, dude. I know I got you in the eye socket a little bit. Not in the eye, just kind of around it. But hey, I think you'll be A-OK. -okay. Mean fish, dude. Welcome to spot number four. Let's do it, dude. Let's do it. Dude, what is back there? Oh, that's a big old house. I'm not going to go back there. That's definitely someone's property. <laughs> we'll cross the banana bridge, though. Let's do it. Oh, there's another big and following it. Oh my God. Oh, got him, got him. Look at that, dude. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Dude, there is no way this is happening right now. <laughs> there is no way this is happening right now. This is, this is so dumb, dude. Literally three minutes later. That's not as big as the last one, but oh my God. Dude, this is, this is the dumbest thing ever. Not as big as the last one, but we'll take it. Dude, walking up on that bridge, he smokes it. So I literally see him come up, follow it like for five seconds, boom, set the hook, run down from the bridge, flip him up, start screaming. Like another three pounder. We're, we're, we're keeping with the three pound game. Three pound and up only today. <sighs> Thank you, buddy. Yes, dude. Yes, came, came right off that stick or something. I'm assuming there's a bed. They both came right from the stick area. I'm assuming this might be the male. The other one might be the female. I don't even think he got that. I don't even think cameraman got that. I was, I was gonna give that guy a, a smooch. It was just, I just love fish so much, but how did I drop him? That is so dumb, dude. Have I like like lost, like I'm a new fisherman now. I never catch fish like this. I never drop a, like how do you just, how does that work? <laughs> Glitch in the system. Somebody press the X, bro. Come on, I know there's a fish in there. 
We've caught fish in plenty of nutty ways and nutty places today. I wouldn't be surprised if we hooked on here. That's supposed to be the cue, come on. Where are you at? Thought you could hear me. 